Hello there, I'm Dr. Brett Brimhall in Mesa, Arizona. Um, we had a class last night on the immune system and how to keep from getting sick this holiday season. I always find it interesting that why did the flu season come this time every year? Uh, did it have anything to do with the fact is that it's a little colder, not much in Arizona, but, or it had to do with we have October, Halloween, November, Thanksgiving, and then Christmas and the New Year's where our consumption of sugar drastically increases. So perhaps that's partially what we deal with with flu season, not only the increase in sweets, decrease of sleep, and increase of stress. So I'm going to give you some very specific guidelines that you can use, both for you and your children, to hopefully avoid the flu if at all possible this year, avoid getting sick, and if you do, some things that you can do to avoid that lasting very long. Okay, so a couple of very specific guidelines you have. Um, some of those are the vitamins and minerals you can take. Now these are things that I use in my own practice, okay, so, and my family. So one of the things I do with my children very commonly every year, when they're going to they're gonna eat sweets, whether you try not to let them, because uh, they're going to get them from their teachers, they're going to get them from church. So when it becomes this time of year, what I do is I have my children take enzymes and I have them take probiotics. So what we use is total enzymes and total probiotics. I start giving my children at least one a day of each of those. Um, I also have them do what's called Chewable C500. It's a product made by Neutral West. This is not it. It looks like this. And I have them do that every single day. That way I know that at least they keep their if, with children, if you keep their digestive tracts healthy, they're less likely to get sick and they're a lot less likely to stay sick very long. So I give them, and this is children from ages from basically, you know, birth to probably about 10 or 11, depending on how big they are, I'll give them one enzyme, one probiotic a day, and one chewable C500. You know, once they're, you know, over about 90, 100 pounds, then I'm going to probably do two a day of each of those. Okay, if they start feeling sick, I'm going to increase those doses as well. Um, <clears throat> one of the things that I'm going to do very commonly with them as well, so if my, ch if my child starts getting sick, so one thing to do to keep them from getting sick, give them enzymes, probiotics, and vitamin C. Keep them healthy, hopefully it will help them process those sugars they are going to get. If they start feeling sick, I'm going to increase that chewable C to three a day. Okay, but vitamin C, once it gets too high, then you get loose stool and then you back off. Alright, so I'll give them probiotics two a day, enzymes two a day, and the chewable C two a day. At that same time, we'll have them do what's called Epsom salt baking soda bath. I'll have them soak in that for 10 to 15 minutes. That, what that's going to do is that's going to help facilitate their body's ability to actually get rid of the infection. Okay? Then I put them to bed. Alright, with adults, um, this time of year, when the stress goes up, you support the adrenals. The, again, the product that I'm going to use is DSF okay, to help with that. Um, at the same time, what I do, I'm someone that should probably get sick every year because I'm around sick people. Okay, what I do this time of year, I take extra DSF and I take what's called total virex. So here's the rule of thumb. To keep yourself from being sick, if you're one of the people that are exposed to a lot of things, if you're a teacher, you know, if you happen to work in a daycare, you know, if you're around a lot of people that are sick in a big you know, company, I would probably always take one virex a day and support your adrenal glands, especially if you're one of the individuals that stress a lot. If you start feeling sick, what I would do, I, as soon as I start feeling even inkling, which inkling of a, being sick, whether that's a sore throat, whether that's you know congestion, you know, or I'm just my demands go up. I'm not getting much sleep. I'm going to start taking one Virex at the first sign of feeling sick every hour. So I'll take one every hour that I'm awake. So I'm usually getting anywhere from eight to ten in a day, and I'll do that for usually two to three days, or until I feel like my body's actually winning, or I feel like my body's actually taking control of that infection that's there. Once I feel that, then I'll drop down to one three times a day for thirty days, and then back to one a day. Usually till about February, March, where typically your stress levels change a little bit. There's not much sugar consumption. All right. <clears throat> what I do from there um, is I'm going to make sure that I'm doing the other things I can physically to help myself out. So, if personally, if I'm feeling sick, the first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to start taking Virex, DSF. I'm going to personally get adjusted. I'm going to get a massage. Um, in our office, we use foot baths and saunas. So I'll do that. I'll go home and do an Epsom salt bath, and then I'll go to bed. Okay, doing those things is going to enhance your, what your body's trying to do anyway, giving it the right nutrition, getting the right sleep, and your body's going to heal. So with your children, keep it really simple. You know, if their colon's healthy, they're going to stay healthy. Enzymes, probiotics, the vitamin C. As an adult, I typically use total virex if it's more bacterial. I use what's called total multi-immune. Use those things along with the techniques that you know: the chiropractic, the massage, you know, the the Epsom salt baths, foot baths and saunas. You have them, the virex and the multi-immune. If you do those things, you're less likely to get sick this year. Your, your illness is not going to last near as long. So do those things, and you'll be a lot better off this year. Good luck.